morning. Myself, Dr. D. Arun Chirinivas from JP College of Engineering. We have uh, installed a solar panel uh, fed uh, dryer system. Now this solar panel rating is 100 watts. The advantage of a dryer is to remove water content from vegetables as well as foods so that its lifetime can be prolonged. The shelf life of uh, uh, the products, vegetable products that are dehydrated uh, can increase by about uh, 3 to 6 months. Uh, we can discuss further in detail about this solar panel after reaching inside the dryer. Now this is a solar dryer. Uh, we have purchased this uh, from ATR Solar. We can infer from this panel, we can infer the temperature as well as the humidity. Uh, normally, uh, we maintain a temperature around 60 to 65 degrees Celsius. The average temperature will be maintained around 60 to 65 degrees Celsius. Whereas the humidity uh, percentage will be somewhere around 50%. Uh, it depends upon uh, the uh, vegetable products that are facing that we are placing inside the dryer. So, continuous monitoring can be performed from these uh, panel as well as the same data can be transferred and they can be transferred to a mobile phone handheld device and can be can, uh, monitored periodically. Uh, this solar dryer has uh, exhaust fans which are used for these, uh, this is a 12 volt system. So the supply for this uh, uh, fan is through, is, is supplied through the solar panel that is placed uh, above from which the DC supply is carried. Normally a solar panel will be producing DC supply. Uh, this DC supply is fed to this fans for exhausting the excess heat that is built within this room. The uh, temperature variation is uh, uh, attained through the polycarbonate sheets. Now this is a, a 6 mm polycarbonate sheet. This helps to maintain the humidity within this room. The square feet, uh, it is 275 square feet by using these sensors. Thank you.